Hi community of awesome, I'm Gabe and this is Bookish Pixie. New question to answer, let's jump right in. Here's my question, any tips on how to make romance not the main point of the story? Like how in Harry Potter the main point is wizards and stuff, not Ginny and Harry. I love this question because I love writing mushy romances. Oh my god, I am such a sucker for romantic subplots. But even though I really love writing mushy romances, I don't write category romance. I like writing speculative fiction because I like magic and science fiction and cool speculative stuff in my writing, which doesn't always lend itself really to category romance. But you don't have to write category romance in order to have romance in your books. So how do you do it? Well, different writers will tackle it differently, but I'm going to talk about how I handle it. So all of my books have some sort of romantic element at varying levels of intensity. Namely because I'm a big romantic, what can I say? But I look at it all through a lens of character development, which for me happens organically when I'm writing. That said, that doesn't mean I don't plan it at all. Before I start writing, I have a general sense of the characters, including who I think will end up with who. But I try not to be really strict about where I place the milestones. So like when I'm plotting, I'll put like these two characters kiss in this scene. But to be honest, in reality, when I'm writing, that almost never actually matches up to the exact space that I said it would. I mean, sometimes it does, just not most of the time. Because for me, the most important milestones I need to be hitting for the plot are the actual plot. The character relationships are also important, but those develop along the way. And ultimately, when I tell my characters, you're gonna fall in love on this page, they don't really listen to me. But that's just my process, because in my process, I figure out a lot about character while I'm writing. That's where I learn their personalities and who they really are, and also how they're actually going to interact with each other. So I take those sparks of dynamics that I figure out in that first draft, and then I build on it when I'm revising. So to me, the important thing is to get a sense of the dynamics of your characters, and then focus on the plot, and let your characters interact the way they will while the plot happens. So to me, the important thing is to get a sense of your character's dynamics and then focus on the plot and let your characters interact the way they will while the plot happens. Think of it as the characters doing the plot, right? Whatever the plot is, whether it's saving the world or their town or whatever, and then catching feels for each other while they're on their journey. All you really need to do while you're plotting is leave room for scenes for characters to get to know each other. But the main thing is to focus on your plot because that is the most important part. And then just sprinkle in the cuteness and the crush feels and the kissing along the way. So that's what I got for today. If you liked what you saw, don't forget to subscribe and comment, and I'll see you guys soon.